Hi, this is Alex. And this is Lindsay. And we are with Playbill Video here in Times Square at the TKTS line. And today we are going to give two people a reservation for two at the restaurant Sardi's and two free tickets to Spring Awakening. Now, Spring Awakening is a winner of eight Tony Awards, including Best Musical. It's one of the hottest tickets in town, and it's not available on the TKTS line. So this is going to be really exciting. Let's go check it out. Hi, so can you state your name and where you're from? I'm Sophie, I'm from London. I'm Rosanna and I'm from Mexico. I'm Deanna, I'm from Niagara Falls, Canada. I'm Davin from Melbourne, Australia. If there is any Broadway show that you could see right now, what would it be? Lemurs. Lemurs. We're hoping to see Phantom of the Opera. Legally Blonde. Chorus Line. Definitely. Chorus Line. Chicago. Chorus Line. Hairspray. Chorus Line. Hairspray. I'm Jen Shine from Denver, Colorado. Uh, Hugh Daly from Denver as well. So if you could see any show on Broadway, any show, what would it be? Um, I'd have to say Spring Awakening. So what we have for you tonight is two tickets to Spring Awakening, house seats. Wow, thank you. And also a dinner for two at Sardi's. Great, wow. thank you so much. Yeah, look at that. So we'll meet you after the show and you'll tell us what you thought of it. How are you feeling right now? I'm thrilled, thank you so much. This is our last night in New York, so this is a real special treat. Now we're outside of Sardi's, a very famous restaurant here in the theater district. Now what have you heard about Sardi's? Well, I've heard it's um, a great place that's got great Italian food. There's caricatures of all the different celebrities that have been here to the restaurant. And I've also heard that occasionally a celebrity can be cited here. Sardi's has been known in this community since 1921. Um, and it goes hand in hand with theater. If you're talking about theater and, and having dinner before a show, um, we're right located in the heart of the theater district. Um, just like Playbill goes hand in hand with theater, it, uh, we're kind of the same. All right, guys, so how was the dinner? Oh, it was fantastic. I had the uh, scallops, and oh, it was, it was wonderful. And what did you have, sir? I had the pasta with shrimp, uh, delicious, glass of wine, very good. Great. So now that the dinner is over, now it's time to head to the show. Winner of eight Tony Awards, Spring Awakening is one of the must-see shows on Broadway. Now let's follow our lucky couple through the rest of their exciting evening. So guys, how'd you like the show? Oh, it was it was amazing. I really loved the music. It was completely moving. It, it, it exceeded my expectations. Well, I thought it was great. It was kind of a historical piece with modern day lyrics and, and music. I just can't say enough good things about it. I would definitely recommend it to anybody who comes to New York and wants to see a great Broadway show. You guys might think that your night is over, but it actually is not. Playbill has a little surprise for you. In just a few moments, we will bring you backstage and uh, you will meet John Gallagher Jr. who won the Tony for Best Supporting Actor. I will be giving you this very microphone and you will be interviewing him yourself and asking any questions you would like and we'll catch you inside. Howard Hi, Hugh, nice Hi. to meet you. Nice to meet you. I'm Jen, nice to meet you. Hi. How are you guys? Yeah, this is you? awesome. Well, what did you do to prepare for this role? The preparation was a lot of, you know, a lot of just amazing rehearsals. Our director, Michael Mayer, is really good in the rehearsal room and really gives the actor a lot of freedom. He certainly gave me a lot of freedom. I worked on my voice a lot, tried to get my vocal strength uh, in order to, to be able to sustain doing the score, um, you know, eight, eight times a week, which is which can be intense. Cool. Well, John, I've got one for you. Jen and I were disagreeing during the show about what our favorite song was mm -hmm. and what our favorite piece was. Which one is yours? Oh, that's hard to say. I really am partial, not just because I sing it, to, to the Don't Do Sadness, Blue Wind, um, the, the combination of those two songs. That was, when I first heard the music from Spring Awakening, that was one that really jumped out at me. I, I heard, they just gave me a demo, and it was our composer, Duncan Sheik, singing all the songs himself. And I listened to it, and that was the song that I really kind of, when I got to that one, I, I had to play it again and, and hear it a, a couple more times. And at that point, I didn't even know who was going to play who. I didn't know, what didn't have like a list of what character was singing what, and I had no idea that it was end up being my song. And when they told me, I was like, I can't sing that. <laughs> I was going to ask you if the do on stage was the real deal or if this is more like what you... Well, it, I mean, it, the the hair, my hair on stage, which is a little extreme, is my real hair. Some people think sometimes that it's not this, that it's a wig or some kind of hair piece, but it is all this. And, uh, you, you know, it takes a lot of hairspray and a couple of combs and a blow dryer to get it up like that. But uh, I, um, when we were off Broadway, we were kind of this little show and word of mouth show. Not a lot of people knew about us. And I used to actually ride the subway home with my, with my hair like that sometimes last summer. It was a much more carefree time. Yeah, it's just been a real blast. And we just want to say thanks a lot. It's oh, been my awesome. pleasure. Yeah. Thank you. 
Thank you guys. Yeah. Thank you for the time. Well, I hope you guys had an awesome time at the show and at Sardi's. And I hope this will bring you back to New York City to experience Broadway yet again. Absolutely. Definitely. Uh, this was a great night, and we want to thank you guys as well. It was just a real blast. Oh, well, it's definitely our pleasure. And uh, this is Alex with Playbill.com, and we are signing off. See you next time.